I'm going to quickly show you how you can copy your operating system from your old NVMe disk to your new one, even if you just have one M2 slot in your motherboard. I guess you're watching this video because you are in the same predicament that I was. I saw this really cheap NVMe disk that's a lot faster than my old one, so I bought it thinking I could have a really easy upgrade to a fast system. Anyway, after I opened up my PC to my horror, there was only one M2 slot. So how do you clone your operating system from your old NVMe disk to a new one when you just have one slot? Number one, you buy a new motherboard that has at least two M2 slots. Well, that's not such a great option considering that you probably wanted a cheap upgrade. Number two, you can get one of these things, which is a M2 enclosure. You pop in your NVMe disk in here and you use a USB connection to connect it to your computer. Now I tried using this and it was an epic fail. I got to 1% left of the cloning and it got stuck there so there was an error. Apparently sometimes when you try and clone your old NVMe disk to your new one which is in a USB enclosure, it can cause some issues and may not even work at all. Number three, if you have more than one drive in your PC, what you can do is you can clone your operating system from your old NVMe drive to that spare drive and then take out your old NVMe drive, put in your new NVMe drive and then you can clone from that drive to your new NVMe disk. Now this is quite a feasible option, however you need to back up your old drive and if you're using a hard disk drive um, and not an SSD, it may take quite a long time to do the cloning. Number four, which is what I did, you can go out and buy an SSD SATA drive and you can clone from your old NVMe to that SATA drive, replace the NVMe with the new one and then clone from your SATA drive to the new NVMe disk. Now the benefit of this is that you don't have to back up anything as compared to when you're using an existing drive that you have. Now also, as it is an SSD drive, the cloning will be a lot faster going from your SSD to the NVMe drive. And also for many SSD brands, you'll actually get free software that will enable you to clone from one drive to another. What I found in my experience is that a lot of the free software that supposedly enables you to clone your operating system from your old drive to your new drive actually isn't free. When you try and do that, it will actually get you to upgrade to a paid version. So yeah, getting a cheap SSD drive is my preferred option. If you want to support this channel, please check out the links in the description below to buy an SSD drive that comes with cloning software. Thanks for watching.